Senseless gun violence snatches another young life from a KCK community. 16 year old Khalif L. Ron Hampton was killed after a drive by shooting. And KBC 9 Scott McDonald took a tour through the home that was riddled with bullet holes. Scott? Right on Friday night, Wyandotte County Sheriff's broke up a fight here. And while they were at the hospital talking to a patient, someone who was injured in that fight, more violence erupted. This time it wasn't fists that were flying, but bullets. And tonight, a teenager is dead. Friends arriving Monday with t shirts to remember 16 year old Khalif Laurent Hampton. The front door they enter through still stained with a bloody handprint as the 16 year old tried to flag down an ambulance. There was no point to take my brother. There was no point to shoot. There was no point to do any of this. Walls in the townhome on North 70 Terrace, an alphabet of evidence. Bullets fired from outside in without care or concern of who they hit. How many gunshots came through here, do you think? Five. Five gunshots. My brother, baby mama, got hit with two. My brother, Kaylee, got hit with one right here at this door. The wounds were fatal for their 16 year old brother, a basketball player who went to high school in KCK. I know the F boy is the one that hit my brother. What started as a scuffle escalated to murder. Now a family facing the holidays feeling empty. Now I can't spend Christmas with my brother or joke around with my brother no more. So they took that from me. They took my joy and all that from me. I went door to door talking to folks in this community and those apartments over there. They tell me last couple of months have been rough, lots of fights, lots of altercations. Reporting live in KCK, Scott McDonald, KMBC 9 News.